powerful morning prayer to the Holy Spirit for the gift of knowledge. Hello friends, it's Joseph, and thank you for joining me with Mary, the big family that helps you to pray. Please subscribe now and click on the bell to be sure to receive all of our new prayers and updates. Welcome to this new day of our novena to the Holy Spirit, where we ask him especially for the gift of knowledge, which is the gift of seeing God at work in our lives and in the world. It is a magnificent gift because it makes us enter into the endless gratitude and praise, because wherever we look, all creation tells us of God's goodness for us. I suggest that we ask for this gift in our morning prayer so that we can be amazed all day long by all the works of God that we will come across on our way. I invite you to ask for this gift in a special way in the comments of the video, as well as to entrust all your prayer intentions for ourselves, for our families, for this world, and all the places where we need this gift of the Holy Spirit. If you discovered this prayer today, I invite you to join our great novena to the Holy Spirit, which is accessible at this moment and at any time of the year. And you can do this by clicking the link in the description of the video. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father, the Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and on the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Beloved Father, we offer you in this joyful rosary all the intentions of the Immaculate Heart of Mary. We entrust to you the Church, the Pope, the bishops, the priests and deacons, all the religious and consecrated people. We also entrust to you all the faithful that we are, so that you may send us your Holy Spirit, to whom we ask on this day the gift of knowledge. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. We enter into these joyful mysteries of the Holy Rosary by renewing the promises of our baptism. Holy Spirit, renew our lives, renew our hearts, through the gift of knowledge and by the powerful prayer of the Virgin Mary our mother. I, an unfaithful sinner, renew and ratify today, through you, my baptismal promises. I renounce forever Satan, his empty promises and his evil designs, and I give myself completely to Jesus Christ, the incarnate wisdom, 
to carry my cross after him for the rest of my life and to be more faithful to him than I have been till now. This day, with the whole court of heaven as witness, I choose you, Mary, as my mother and queen. I surrender and consecrate myself to you, body and soul, with all that I possess, both spiritual and material, even including the spiritual value of all my actions, past, present, and to come. I give you the full right to dispose of me and all that belong to me, without any reservations, in whatever you please, for the greater glory of God, in time and through eternity. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, come, and from your celestial home shed a ray of light divine. Come, Father of the poor, come, source of all our store, come within our bosom shine. You, O oh, comforters the best, you, the soul's most welcomed guest, sweet refreshment here below. In our labor, rest most sweet. Grateful coolness in the heat, solace in the midst of woe. O oh, most blessed light divine, shine within these hearts of yours, and our inmost being fill, where you are not, we have naught. Nothing good indeed or thought, nothing free from taint or ill. Heal our wounds, our strength renew. On our dryness pour your dew. Wash the stains of guilt away. Bend the stubborn heart and will. Melt the frozen, warm the chill. Guide the steps that go astray. On the faithful who adore and confess you evermore. In your sevenfold gift descend. Give them virtue's sure reward. Give them your salvation, Lord. Give them joys that never end. Amen. Alleluia. The first joyful mystery, the Annunciation, from the Gospel of St. Luke. Then the angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. Behold, you will conceive in your womb and bear a son, and you shall name him Jesus. He will be great and will be called Son of the Most High, and the Lord God will give him the throne of David his father, and he will rule over the house of Jacob forever, and of his kingdom there will be no end. Mary said, Behold, I am the handmaid of the Lord. May it be done to me according to your word. Then the angel departed from her. In this mystery, Lord, we contemplate your plan of love and peace your plan of grace and salvation, which takes a decisive step through Mary's yes, the step of the incarnation of the Word of God. Lord, how beautiful is your creation, how precious is this world in your eyes that you come to live in and dwell with us. We ask you for the gift of knowledge in this mystery, the gift in which we marvel at your works, the gift in which everything we see tells us of your praise and blessing. You arrange everything wonderfully, Lord, and the wonder of wonders you have arranged, the Immaculate Heart of Mary, the Immaculate Conception, to welcome you into this world. Dear friends, for those who have received the gift of knowledge, everything speaks of God and his goodness. So I propose to you in this mystery to make in the commentary, a beautiful praise to the Lord for all the things that surround us, for all that he has arranged to make us happy. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, and save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. The Second Joyful Mystery, The Visitation From the Gospel of St. Luke When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the infant leapt in her womb, and Elizabeth, filled with the Holy Spirit, cried out in a loud voice and said, Most blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. And how does this happen to me, that the mother of my Lord should come to me? For at the moment the sound of your greeting reached my ears. The infant in my womb leapt for joy. Blessed are you who believe that what was spoken to you by the Lord would be fulfilled. In this mystery, Lord, we want to praise you for the gift of friendship, the gift of relationships. Through the gift of knowledge, we see that all relationships are gifts of your love to move us towards the kingdom of heaven. Thank you for our family, our friends, our colleagues. Thank you for those people we meet every day. Thank you for those you put in our path to help us move forward. Thank you for this family of prayer with Mary. Lord, we ask you through the gift of knowledge to keep us from all criticism, from all gossip, from all breakups, from all conflicts, from all jealousy, and to transform all into praise as in a great, permanent magnificat. Dear friends, perhaps it is time to make a personal decision now to stop all criticism and ask for this grace 
the gift of knowledge for today, from morning until night, to praise the Lord at all times. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. The Third Joyful Mystery, The Nativity of Our Lord From the Gospel of St. Luke Now there were shepherds in that region, living in the fields and keeping the night watch over their flock. The angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were struck with great fear. The angel said to them, Do not be afraid, for behold, I proclaim to you good news of great joy that will be for all the people. For today, in the city of David, a Saviour has been born for you, who is Messiah and Lord, and this will be a sign for you. You will find an infant wrapped in swaddling clothes, and lying in a manger. In this mystery, Lord, we raise a mighty praise to heaven for your presence with us and amongst us. And you were not just there 2,000 years ago, but you are here with us today. And until the end of the world, 
in the Eucharist, in the Mass, in your sacraments. In this mystery, dear friends, I propose to ask the Holy Spirit for the gift of knowledge for the whole day to be aware of the presence of the Lord with us and to bless Him with His presence. May we be more present to His presence by renewing today many acts of adoration and praise, simply in our hearts, the places we are at, and why not in the participation of the Holy Mass or by making a visit to the Blessed Sacrament. Yes, Lord, like Mary, help us to keep all the events of our lives as treasures where your presence is manifest. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, and save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. The Fourth Joyful Mystery, The Presentation, from the Gospel of St. Luke. Now there was a man in Jerusalem, whose name was Simeon. This man was upright and devout, awaiting the consolation of Israel, and the Holy Spirit was upon him. It had been revealed to him by the Holy Spirit that he should not see death 
before he had seen the Messiah of the Lord. He came in the Spirit into the temple, and when the parents brought the child Jesus in to perform the custom of the law, he took him into his arms and blessed God, saying, Now, Master, you may let your servant go in peace, according to your word, for my eyes have seen the salvation which you prepared in sight of all the peoples, a light for revelation to the Gentiles, and glory for your people Israel. In this mystery, Lord, as we contemplate Mary and Joseph fulfilling the prescriptions of the law in great obedience, we ask you to know how to practice this obedience as well. Dear friends, when the gift of knowledge gives us the ability to see God's wonders everywhere, it is much easier to practice this obedience, which no longer sounds like an obligation, but gives us the joy of accomplishing God's will, of entering into his plan of love. So like Mary and Joseph, Lord, give us the ability to be attentive to your will in the order of things, events, circumstances, history, and to spontaneously and joyfully obey your call to receive an abundance of blessings for our day. Friends, I propose to you to ask for purity in this mystery, purity of thought, of sight, of heart, as a disposition to put no obstacle in the way of God's will today. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. The Fifth Joyful Mystery The Finding of Jesus in the Temple From the Gospel of St. Luke After three days they found him in the temple, sitting amongst the teachers of the law. He listened to them and asked them questions, and all who heard him raved about his understanding and his answers. When the parents saw him, they were astonished, and his mother said to him, My child, why have you done this to us? See how your father and I have suffered in searching for you. And he said to them, How is it that you have sought me? Didn't you know that I must be with my father? But they did not understand what he was saying. In this mystery, Lord, this unveiled episode of your thirty years of hidden life, we ask your Holy Spirit for the gift of knowledge to know how to praise and bless you for all the aspects of our daily life, our work, our family, our health, our finances, the simplest tasks of everyday life, cooking, ironing, cleaning, visiting certain people. Yes, Lord, we too have a hidden life, and yet you do wonders for us at every moment. So, dear friends, I suggest that we entrust to the Lord all of our difficulties, all the blockages of our daily life in the most concrete aspects, so that through praise, blessing, and thanksgiving, the difficulties are unblocked. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. 
Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, and save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. If you enjoyed this joyful rosary to the Holy Spirit, asking for the gift of knowledge, then please like this video and share it with those around you, so that they are renewed in the gifts and grace of the Holy Spirit. To thank you for participating, I want to offer you the free digital ebook, The Five Essential Keys to Praying Better. Please click on the link that appears now or in the comment section below. I also invite you to join the Great Novena to the Holy Spirit. The link is also in the video description. Lord, you have filled us with your Holy Spirit in this rosary through the powerful intercession of the heart of Mary the Immaculate Heart of our Mother. We entrust to you the fruits and graces of this rosary, all the gifts we have received, so that you may make them grow in us. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this veil of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Amen. Sacred Heart of Jesus, I trust in you. Immaculate Heart of Mary, pray for us who have recourse to you. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Michael the Archangel, pray for us. Our holy guardian angel, watch over us. All the angels and saints, pray for us. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you, friends, for this beautiful rosary in the grace of the Holy Spirit. May the Lord continue to work in you through his gifts, and especially in the coming hours through the gift of knowledge. I look forward to praying with you again in the next video. In the joy and peace of God. Amen. Until then, God bless.